Hey, what's up guys? Johnny here back with a brand new COD Mobile video today. The title is One Year of COD Mobile Skins. And we're going to look at all the skins I collected through the first year of Call of Duty Mobile. Check out all the skins, starting with the first season pass ghost. And I have three ghost skins. And probably my favorite one must be the OG one. Uh, but the ghost hazmat, I made a top 10 of my favorite season pass skins. And Ghost Hazmat was also in the top 10. I really love that skin. Now Ghost Cowboy is also from a season pass. Now Soap McTavish, another super cool skin. I think he's in my top 10 also for season pass skins. And that one was in my top 10 for the most colorful skins in the game. I love the hazmat suit. And uh, some guys say it's not very smart because uh, it's kind of exposed, right? He has to zip the hoodie and all that. But super cool skin, by the way. Uh, Captain Price, I only have the OG Price. I didn't buy the lucky draw, the chopper draw. Um, I think it looks pretty cool though. Maybe I should have, but yeah, I don't buy all the lucky draws. Now Mara, there's only one skin for now. I think we have another Mara skin coming soon, guys. Uh, I saw some leaks. I don't know if it's a, a bundle, but we might have another one. Now the Grinch, Night Fang, that's the only one. Also, I kind of like that one. I used that in Battle Royale this week. Mace, how many skins I have? Only two. And Mace Tombstone was still had the, the new tag. I never used it, guys. I don't know, man. I, I'm not the biggest fan of Mace, but I guess it's pretty cool. The mask is nice. Uh, Nikto Stronghold and Nikto, the basic one. That one from uh, Lucky Draw again. And Stronghold, I said it was pretty underrated. I don't see it that often. But then some guys in the comments say there's a lot of bots using that skin. I don't know. I didn't know this for real. Let me know. Like, do you see a lot of bots using this skin? I don't know. Now, next is Golem. Uh, that one's pretty dope for real. I like it. Uh, Yegor, Mr. President Putin. I don't know if you guys like that one. I said it's probably one of the ugliest skins in the game now, right? That one, some guys don't like, but I really like. The UDT Frogman. Otter. I didn't use enough, man. I got that one in a crate. It's actually very cool. Some guys say it's like uh, when you play Attack of the Undead. You can use that one to confuse your opponents, maybe. Now, Alex Mason, maybe underrated, overrated. Let me know. It, it, it was not in my top 10. I got bashed a little bit for that. I don't know. I don't use it. But yeah, it is an OG guy. Plus, it's season two. It's a pretty old skin. Now, David Mason. Again, we use that one in the Protect the President game. It was a lot of fun. I like Mason. It's very, very cool. Now, Kruger. Uh, we do have a couple. But I only have two. I don't know if there's more. Kruger Alchemist. I really like that one. And Kruger Reaper. We just got a new uh, Russian Merc. Looks like that one a lot. Some guys say Ear Reveal. All right. Now, we got Makarov. And I know there's more than one. Pretty sure. I missed the first one. And that one's from a Battle Pass. Now, Siren. Uh, from a recent Lucky Draw. That one's pretty dope also. I like it. Scylla. We're going to have a brand new one in the next season pass, guys. Season 11, Scylla is coming uh, with the blue mask. I don't know if you guys saw the artwork, but she's going to be very awesome. Cannot wait to get it. Now, here's that one. The Russian merc I was just talking about. And uh, some guys say it's not worth the money opening these crates. But I wanted to go for it because I thought it looked pretty cool. And it's different from the other one, right? Now, Gunzo, super popular. Super rare and expensive, man. Anytime there's a lucky draw, you have to... Uh, unless you're lucky, you're going to have to bring the money. Now, Witch Doctor, I don't use it much. But it's also very special. Different from the other ones. Now, Badosphere. Also, I should use more. I never use it. Uh, reminds me of Bioshock. If you guys played Bioshock 1. Bioshock 2, maybe? I don't remember. But I like that one. Super, super cool. Uh, Battle Hardened. It was on my thumbnail today. Some guys asked me what that, what that skin was. It's Battle Hardened. And yeah, he's got great gear. The bullets belt and the axe in the back. Very, very dope. Lots of tattoos also. It's a great skin, guys. Outrider. Man, I said today I only have four. I got the jungle, the arctic. Arctic was a free one. Amazonas from the latest season pass and Outrider Mystic from Bundle Lucky Draws. That one I skipped the last one, but I love the original Reaper. I think it's my favorite. And that one, the grinder is a bit too much going on here in my uh, opinion. That's why I prefer that one. More simple. Plus, I love the color. So next is the battery skin. And I have more than Outrider. Damn, how many? I have two four six seven so first one is battery arctic 
Uh, I think it was a credit store, right? Now, going dark, that one's super rare from the blue crates. I got lucky on that one. Battery torque, one of my biggest mistakes in the whole year of COD Mobile. It was the Black Friday offer. I think I bought 120 crates for that. I should have stopped way before. Uh, half by Valentine from Lucky Draw. I love when they have these uh, little animations. She's awesome. I love that one. Uh, an old Lucky Draw. That one also, one of the oldest Lucky Draws. I think the second one or something like that. That one from uh, Battle Royale and that one from Login Calendar. So yeah, I got a few of these. Next is the Ruin and the Ruin Jungle was one of the old offers, but it came back after. Championship Purple from Stage 2B. Uh, Ruin Jade from an old season pass. Action figure. That one is very unique and I don't see often. I should use it more, man. I have a lot of skins I never use. That one from Battle Whale, pretty popular. And it's free, so. Uh, that one also I think was free. One of these two. I, I can't remember. I think one is from a crate and one was free from a seasonal event. Alright, Prophet. I'm gonna say, guys. I never, I never really liked that skin that much. So Prophet Sight, Prophet Dust Bowl, and Prophet High Voltage, and Prophet Desolate. Uh, I'm missing the Archangel. Probably it's my favorite one of all Prophet skins, and I don't have it. Congrats to you guys if you have the Prophet Archangel. It's very nice. Seraph, one of my favorites, and I like both skins. One of my favorite Season Pass skins, and one of my favorite Lucky Draw skins. It's a bit sad that's maybe a bit too much colorful but that skin is very dope now here's nomad and one of the best free skins ever and one of the worst free skins ever and of course it's personal opinion but to me nomad wild snake has to be one of the best free skins ever in the whole game in one year of cod mobile i always like that skin the voice was nice the the soldier is badass and that one it's just, I don't like it, man. I never liked it. I don't know. It just seems like it doesn't belong, but you guys let me know. Now, that one was more recent. Lattice, the skin. It's like the Wild Snake, but just a different color. I love that one better, guys. So, it was uh, one of the first seasonal events, I think. Let me know if you guys remember. Spectre, the latest skin I got in the game for the one year of COD Mobile was the last Lucky Draw. And the other two Spectre skins I have are freaking dope. That one, Spectre Geist and Spectre Spectral. These skins are very cool, very original. And again, I should use them more often. I just don't. I kind of forget about these. Now, Firebreak is also super cool because you can put the clothing on them. So, Panda, like you see the gear here. And Carrot Thief is the, the rabbit one. So you can put the rabbit hat or the rabbit suit. So hopefully we're going to have more of these in the second year of COD Mobile. Because I think it's nice to customize the skins, right? Next is Tank Dempsey. Uh, one of the OG. The reward from the zombie mode. And then the wrecker from the season pass. Not my favorite. I prefer the old one. Now next one. Nikolai. Uh, and Takeo. And uh, Rick Toffin over there. So the full OG zombie squad. And they don't have variations yet. So there's only one skin for all of these. And now Ted is the only skin for now. But a new one is coming soon for free in the new season. It's been already revealed. Now Reznov, I only have one. I think there's only one also. The Witch Warden. I don't know if I say it right. There's only one. But another zombie character. Uh, Tenju from the last Battle Royale. You only have a couple days left, guys. If you don't have it, go, go, go. Uh, Pilot, some of you guys don't like, but I really love it. And it kind of sucks they put it on some butts now. Phantom, I have the championship one from the Stage 1B or something like that. And then the OG Phantom from the old season pass. Tian Zhao. I think there's two different. One you had to pay and one is free, I think, from the login calendar. FTL, there's only one from Season Pass. Sentinel Recon, only one also. Elite PMC, like I said, I, I did talk about it today. They all look the same to me, but different color variations. So the Going Dark is actually uh, pretty rare from crates. And the original one you could buy 
directly in the store. Now Lovecraft Chinko, I have four. I don't know if there's more, let me know, but I think my favorite one is the second one here, the Soviet dragon from the season pass because of the black coat and the dark, uh, that one's not bad also, but yeah. And that one I think is the original one, the first one that came out in crates. Anyways, uh, let me know in the comments, but that one's my favorite for sure. The captain, there's a few, Black Lime, very special, and Arctic Blizzard, and the original one. I heard it's coming back in bundles, I don't know. Uh, Terrence Brooks, we got a few, that one was super rare. And then the digital hide was also, I think, a seasonal event. Park, brand new from the login calendar. And there's another variation that I didn't buy, it was, I think, in crate. Urban Tracker, nothing to say here, I already said what I had to say. Now, Dead Angel Alice, one of my favorite skins ever, and I love both variations, Trench and the original one. Artery, uh, one of my favorite female skins, maybe my top two. Animation is epic. Yeah, very nice. Hazmat Bomber, like I did talk enough about that one. It's a bit too flashy. That one was free also, login calendar, a couple months ago. American Bulldog. Very unique voice, I think. Now, Spec Ops 2, we're almost done. Uh, we got a new one recently, but the OG was from a very old season. Battle Royale rewards. Spec Ops 4 also used to be super rare. We got a few variations lately. They're not that great. And there's one that I'm missing. All right, next, Spec Ops 5. Uh, I know one of these is from the credit store. Maybe two of these. Let me know. Is it possible two of these from credit store? That's pretty sick. And that one from, I mean... If you started back then, I think it was a reward for logging in seven days or something. Merc 1, the brand new Evil Knievel from Credit Store. I love that one for real. And then Merc 1 Original, might come back later. Merc 2, uh, Copilot, again, I can't remember. I think it was a crate. And the original Merc 2 from Battle Royale. One of the Battle Royale rewards with the big shoulder pads. I like that one also. Man, I like a lot of skins in this game. Merc 5, one of my favorite mercs. My favorite merc, I guess. And the skins, they all look cool. I think this one's coming back, guys. And that one is my rarest. It's from a crate. That one, not my favorite. Maybe my least favorite. That one was free from watching the World Championships. And that's it. I have five merc 5s. Uh, not forgetting that one from Battle Royale. Rewards, free skin, guys. All right, we have three more, guys. Spec Ops 1, Spec Ops 3, and Scout 2. Spec Ops 1... Uh, does the bot skin and then a few variations that one is the most recent I think uh, and I think the desert was from a uh, credit store and that one was an offer you had to buy directly in the store uh, spec ops 3 is the good old pajama boy so that one is the OG pajama boy and that one's the bot skin and iridescent very recent we got that a couple of weeks ago and now scout 2 why scout 2 do we have a scout one I didn't even notice I don't know, maybe we're gonna have Scout 1 someday. And that one, no skin for that. Justice for Scout 2, guys. Hashtag justice for Scout 2. And where's Scout 1? Anyways, that's it, guys. All my collection. But hey, that's it. One year of COD Mobile skins, guys. The new season's coming maybe tomorrow. That's it for now. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And don't forget to subscribe for daily COD Mobile videos. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.